This is a catastrophic bleed box, which is very similar to an external AED box. Now this particular box is available as an internal version, like this one is, with just a standard lock on it, or you can have an external lock with buttons, which actually can be given by the emergency services or certain people can know the code. So in the event of someone needing a catastrophic bleed kit, they enter in the digit code, hit enter, and they'll be able to gain access to it. This particular one's an internal one, so you just turn the knob. Now the idea on the outside is a waterproof case, so it keeps it nice and clean, it keeps it dry, so there's no dust gonna get in, there's no water gonna get in. You can clearly see through the window that the product's in there. So in here you can easily see the kit. You can put different sizes of kit in there as well. Uh, we've got a standard kit of ours in this particular box. The outside of the box is very clear, very bright, um, it's obvious what we're trying to do um, as a bleed control box and the idea is as many people know where this is possible. To open the kit with this one is to turn the handle and you open it up and then you can grab the kit nice and easily out of the box uh, and use it. Now with the kits themselves we talked about the seal around the outside here there's a yellow seal and this seals against um, the outside here and this provides a good watertight seal for the box. Um, as you can see, there's plenty of room inside if you were going to have a larger kit, a multi-use kit, uh, or any of the other kits on the market. Um, with this particular kit here, this is a standard uh, access kit, and inside here we've got trauma dressings, we've got cellox, we've got uh, rapid stop tourniquets, um, foil blankets, shears, and lots of other things to actually help control a catastrophic bleed. Now once this kit has been taken out, you'd need to report to the people who are managing the box to say the kit has been used because they need to get a new kit and put it back in the box. So if you have had to use this for any reason, then make sure you contact the person who's managing the box so that they can restock it. Their details will usually be inside the box or on the outside of the box so you can contact them.